So we've now seen a number of these rappers trying to sing. Kim Paluta, Amrado. We've seen uh, Kwame Yogurt and the rest. It's not new though, but what do you think would push some of these rappers to get into singing? Vernacular rap. Rappers, yeah. Okay, let me put it this way. From where I sit, it's easy to to sell vernacular in a singing format than in a rap format because rap sing songs have melody <coughs> rap songs are words so the beats drive rap songs there's no melody in the singing if you listen to zibote yeah. we still don't know what you were talking about mm -mm -mm, okay but we love it because it's a sing song got premier gao uh, recently, I saw a TikTok video mm -hmm. translating the words. I never thought of it. <laughs> I never knew these words. And so, what I've deduced from this is that uh, it is easier for a sing song to cross over like Ashake yeah. with the Yoruba. Okay. He can cross over with it because it's a sing song. Because of the melody. But if you rap in Yoruba, you go hung. Combedo rough. So the whole point about this thing is that Sakori has suffered out there. The reason why he has transformed to an English rapper is he has to mm. move on. Mm. Because the vernacular rap will limit you. Mm. And so he has done well with this new the new the, the last album, No Pressure. Yeah. Um, that was a crazy English rap. I I could I didn't even think that Sakodia could rap that much English. You know? I was very, very, very impressed. But, but one thing Sakodia also does is to lace his verses with catchy choruses. So he would employ a singer or somebody who can do hooks Obviously, for him. I mean, you, you a hook is a hook. You yeah. need a, a nice hook. Yeah. But people have to get into you, mm. the mm. artist. Mm. 